हेलो गाइस टुडे वी विल डिस्कस द फर्स्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म इन द फंक्शनल डिपेंडेंसी एंड नॉर्मलाइजेशन सेक्शन द फर्स्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस दैट द व्हाट इज द नॉर्मल फॉर्म इट इज द बेसिकली अ सिंपल प्रोसेस और स्टेप बाय स्टेप प्रोसेस बाय व्हिच वी कैन रिमूव द रिडंडेंसी एंड एनोमलीज फ्रॉम द टेबल तो वी विल डिस्कस फर्स्ट द फर्स्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म इन केबीएमएस तो फर्स्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म सेज दैट द अ रिलेशन इज इन द फर्स्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म इफ डोमेन ऑफ ईच एट्रीब्यूट कंटेन्स ओनली अटोमिक वैल्यूज दैट मीन्स कि इफ वी हैव अ टेबल एंड इन दैट टेबल वी हैव द ऑल द एट्रीब्यूट दैट एट्रीब्यूट डोमेन दैट मीन्स द वैल्यूज अंडर दैट एट्रीब्यूट शुड कंटेन द अटोमिक वैल्यूज रिगार्डिंग टू द अदर एट्रीब्यूट लाइक सी सो इन फर्स्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म वी हैव टू क्रिएट द अटोमिसिटी इन दैट टेबल तो वी विल टेकिंग थ्री एग्जाम्पल हेयर एंड सी हाउ वी कैन कन्वर्ट दैट table under uh, in the first normal form let's see uh, there is a this table this table contains the id name age and the phone don't think the, this id is a primary key now we are not taking or assuming it's a primary key we just taking this the normal attribute so in this uh, in this table what we have we have a id 1 that name is x then age is 32 and this phone is 666 okay guys in this way if we come to the point 3 id that its name is age and the 42 its age but we have two values here that two phone number is here the id 3 contains two phone number that is 888 and the 222 but it is a multi valued attribute we have already discussed in the er section that is anti relationship diagram so this table is our table which has the multi valued attribute so we have to convert that table in the first normal form because in the point of 3 that means we have a, a two values that should not be there it says there should be an atomicity okay guys so for making this table under in the first normal form what we have to do we will convert this this value in the on the basis of these all attributes so we will take 3 here z here 42 here and the triple two row uh, triple two phone number again here okay guys so we will take this again a new row or new tuple in which we put the all the values here okay guys so this is the way we can convert the this multi valued attribute relation into the first normal form then there is another example like see we have an id name and address so in the one x we have an address like 74a block 7 delhi then india many thing address see address contains a lots of thing here ki like street number block city then in a uh, country so we have uh, it is like a composite attribute address is made from the city in a uh, city country street number many things pin code sometimes so we have to uh, divide that attribute that is address from the this composite attribute so we have, here we are converting this address into the its regarding composite attribute like see address where we how we can divide that column into the street city state okay on that basis we are putting the state is 74 a block 7 then delhi that if there is a country then we also add the country from india so it's all up to you how you can divide this composite attribute but we will remove the this address column completely okay guys and from which this address is made up of we will take that column in the sense okay so this is the way how we can com uh, convert the composite attributes in one normal form we have to remove that column ex completely but we will add the its composite attributes here okay guys in the next uh, uh, in the next example we have the id name date of joining and work experience this is dog is the date of joining we have an employee id 1 its name is x its joining date is to 16th may 2000 ad 18 and from that date now work experience is now 3 years okay but we have seen that we can calculate this value by some formulas okay so we not uh, we don't need any kind of key we go there and uh, type every value here the work experience is 3 2 1 no we do not need this kind of column here so we will remove that column into the new table okay we will remove because how we can calculate the work experience if somebody ask me ki tell me the work experience of id 2 person okay so we will go there and the first the we will take in a formula like the current system date is this minus the joining date what it will give us give us the time uh, it will give the exact duration that is the year then month then days 
तो वी विल गेट दैट वर्क एक्सपीरियंस हेयर बाई कैलकुलेटिंग तो वी डोंट नीड दैट वर्क एक्सपीरियंस कॉलम हेयर we will remove that column in a new table okay guys so this is the way how we can remove the derived attribute this is a derived attribute basically we can derive it we can calculate it we do not need any kind of this kind of uh, column to add go there to have it, this kind of column in a table and add the values there no we don't need this kind of thing the column which can be derived or this values can be derived we will take out from that and we will just take the remaining columns okay so this is the way how we can convert the table into the one and of one so this is all about the how we can convert in the first example multi valued attributes in the second example we converted the composite attributes into the one and of form and in the last example we converted derived attribute into the one and of form so this is the basically all about the converting the a table into the one and of form or the first normal form in the next session we will discuss the some points regarding the functional dependency and after that we will discuss the how we go for the second normal form so let's ready for the functional dependency in the next session if my videos are helping you so please like and share this videos and subscribe the channel and please do follow the playlist of these videos and its link is under the description so guys please follow the playlist i am requesting you so you will not will not skip any videos here okay thank you and take care